This guy's a nut, but he's a rich nut. May I tell you what I think happened? Alrighty then. Jim Carrey is Hollywood's hot flavor. He's gone from a paycheck in the thousands to one in the millions, and it's all because of this surprise hit, Ace Ventura, Pet Detective. Now Mr. Carrey is in an even crazier comedy. It's called The Mask. What are you doing down there? I'm just looking for my mask. It seems a guy finds a mask with special powers. Only an actor with a rare degree of fool power can pull this one off. Who can? It's just uh, basically uh, all work right now, you know? I'm like on a whistle-stop campaign, you know? <laughs> you know? <laughs> a lot of promotion, a lot of talking. A lot of, lot of baby kissing and all that stuff. You, you know? happy? I mean, is it like the best time of your life? It is. It is. You know, it's a, it's a very strange thing. It's like, but there's, there's always other things going on, too. I mean, every, everybody has their yin and yang, you know? So, so uh, you know, but at the same time I was doing Ace, I was getting divorced. And so, you know, it was like the best and the worst time of my life at the same time, you know? See, Mark? Jim Carrey's world is spinning right now. He's headed soon for the Batman set, replacing Robin Williams as the Riddler. Recently, he went to the Big Can Film Festival. All I heard over there was, hey, Gerard Depardieu, Gerard Depardieu. You know, like that kind of thing. Large crowds would, like, file by, and all you'd hear is, Gerard Depardieu, Gerard Depardieu. Looking back at this young man's life, it seems he's always been a little different. My report card every year said, Jim finishes his work first and bothers the other students. You know, and, and so... I, I finally kind of clued into a, a system, you know, with this one teacher that I had in the seventh grade, and she said, I'll give you 15 minutes at the end of the day if you don't bother anybody, kind of thing. And so, you know, my, ho my whole day was spent, like, you know, coming up with my set. <laughs> so there was no question where you were going from an early age, right? It's not, maybe not exactly know where you were going like the mask. I had no idea how to get there. You were going there. to go somewhere. I had no idea how to get there, but, I, but it's exactly what I wanted to do. It's for you. <laughs> With all the movies in Jim Carrey's future, there is no more living color on television. And Jim says that's okay. Before I found out that, uh, they, that they decided to just kind of let me go and say goodbye, um, I was already, you know, creating ideas for the next season, you know. Mothman was one, one that I was put, pinning a lot of hopes on. <laughs> it's just this, this guy. <laughs> You know, and I just flutter around in the lights and fly into closets and, you know, ruin people's clothes. Well.